Hello my friends, welcome to my channel. I am Ika. If you have been here before, welcome back. If you are new, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. I upload uh, videos quite often and who knows, I might be an inspiration to you. Um, as I uh, took the Christmas decorations down, which probably many of you remember were uh, mostly white and silver, um, I started to replace them with warmer colors like um, gold and uh, um, creams and uh, you know, you get the point. Um, but a few days ago, one of my friends uh, decided to get me a gift uh, from Marshalls where she works and uh, um, I absolutely love it but that prompted the change of my entire kitchen here it is she got me these um, beautiful gold uh, cheese knives set uh, they're absolutely gorgeous. I love them, but um, now I had to change my entire kitchen, which I did. Here is what I introduced, more gold. I don't keep a lot on my counter because um, my kitchen is quite small and my pantry is just a few steps away with, and I have a large pantry. You, uh, you, you've probably seen it in, in other videos. Um, so I am not too lazy to walk there. I, I like to keep my counter um, clutter free. So I only keep absolutely what I need and um, what I use very like every day. However, I like to decorate my counter all the time. So my daughter laughed. She said, I don't know, you don't have many things that you use on this counter, <laughs> but uh, that's the way I like it. That's me. That may not be you, but that's me. Here are um, my uh, fine china which was hidden in my china cabinet and I decided to bring it up I decided to uh, put it in my uh, here is an, uh, another set and this one I brought from Romania many 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 years ago and here is another one that I, I think I bought on a shopping channel here in Canada. I just absolutely loved this. Well, it's only part of it because it, I couldn't fit it all in here. So part of it is still in the china cabinet, but um, you get the idea. Oh, these are the these are the cups from the set gold set gold and white set but yeah that's my um, gold color introduced to my um, to my kitchen uh, which brings me to today's video I am now on to my living room a while ago I painted this starburst I had put all the colors that at the time were in my uh, living room, uh, browns and some greens and uh, silver, of course. But now I decided to add some gold to it. I hope I'm not going to screw it up, but um, if push comes to shove, it's only paint. I can always repaint the whole thing. 
that. Without further ado, and let me get into finishing this beauty. And I will uh, show you how it looks in the end. Thank you for watching again. And I hope you stay with me uh, to the end of this video. I am using this um, Americana Metallics uh, paint. I bought it at Michael's a while ago. Okay, so my painting is done. I love it. Maybe I should have added a little bit more um, glitter, but I think it's sparkly enough. And you can also see the gold. I, I wanted to add some gold glitter, which I did uh, right there in the middle. I don't know if you can see it or not. But um, yeah, I am I am pleased with it. The only thing I don't know if I like is it looks too small above the sofa all by itself. So I am just thinking maybe at some point soon I will put something on each side of it. Maybe a couple of sconces maybe i will paint something similar but um yeah that's how it is right now what do you think tell me what do you think what should i put should i replace the large lumps on each side with two smaller ones and then add something on each side of the painting or I kind of like it like that. It's um, you can't really see it in the in the video, but.
but in reality it looks um, it doesn't look clutter it, it looks nice with the with a lot with the big lumps on each side but um, yeah tell me tell me what you think I should do there I also moved the fireplace now because you remember if you remember where the sofa is right now it used to be the fireplace and uh, actually that painting was meant for about the my the fireplace maybe that's what i will do i will replace it but no it's it's too big it's too big for above the fireplace so i put this mirror i don't even know about this i tried to balance uh, both sides i um, have those three candle holders and then i have a vase but i also put a large um, candle in it you can probably see it uh, and then i don't know about this candle holder in the middle i just sort of like threw it in there but i don't think i like that i I should probably maybe put a couple of books and something smaller in on top of them hmm. tell me what you think I'm really curious like I, I kind of just threw everything together for for the video but um, yeah I'm probably going to change a lot of it as for my dining room table I replaced the mirror the mirror tray that was um, on the table with uh, this pretty thing I bought a while ago from uh, Pier 1 I believe I can't remember how much I paid for it it wasn't too expensive but it's really pretty I haven't used it in a while so I decided it's all beads can probably see it and then I uh, put this ornate vase and just put a few uh, branches in it like really light flowers I didn't want a lot of uh, a lot of things put in the vase because I didn't want I didn't want it I didn't want the flower arrangement to take from the vase. So yeah, that's about it for today. Uh, maybe in the next few days I will I will um, change it again if I get any no, new ideas. Maybe you guys are going to give me some ideas. Uh, but um, yeah, thank you so much for watching and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I will see you in my next video. Have a great day.